In this video, we will demonstrate the capturing of UI elements for a mobile app using Fireflank Finder tool. Go to the Fireflank Finder and click on the mobile tab to start capturing the UI elements. Fireflank Finder can generate locators for elements of any app, either from an Android or an iOS device that is connected to the system, or from an emulator or a simulator as well. In this video, we will be capturing the UI elements on a mobile device that is connected to the system. Once the device is connected, click on the Select Device drop-down and choose the device. Fireflank Finder will automatically choose the platform once the device selection is made, depending on whether it is an Android or an iOS device. Now, click on the Select App drop-down which will display all the apps that are present on that mobile device. Select the app for which the UI elements have to be captured. Once the app is selected, hit the Start Recording Elements button, which will launch the selected app, directly taking the user to the app's landing screen. Now, the user has to perform a single-click action on each element for which the locators have to be generated. Click on the Stop Recording Elements button. Now click on the Elements button to view the list of the captured elements. The user can now view the list of UI elements with its auto-generated element name and type, along with multiple optimal locators. Click on the drop-down to view the list of the recorded locators for the element. To move the recorded elements from the Fireflank Finder to the Fireflank platform, click on the checkbox present next to the elements. Now, the Move button will be enabled. After this, choose the project to which the elements have to be moved to. Now, click on the Assign Screen button. The screens and subscreens from the Fireflank repository will be displayed. Choose the desired screen and click on the Select button. Now, it's time to move all the captured elements by clicking on the Move button. To check whether the elements are successfully moved, go to the Repository section within Fireflank platform. Click on the drop-down and select Android to view the list of Android elements. Here, you will find all the elements that are moved from the Fireflank Finder tool in the respective screen. In conclusion, we have discussed how a user can quickly build an element repository for a mobile app within Fireflank using the smart Fireflank Finder tool. For more information, visit fireflank.com and schedule a free demo today.